Amazon Prime Watch, the number one show and watch your business transform. Call us at 294-4081-225-4327 or 225-3250. Is your vehicle in need of repairs and you're tired of paying expensive prices for inferior parts? Then Car City Trading is your solution. We carry a wide range of high quality brand new Korean auto parts at unbeatable prices. From the smallest sensors to a complete nose cut, head and block suspension, body and electrical parts, engine parts, cooling systems, compressors, alternators, starters and more. We are ready to serve you at Lot 78 Bamboo Settlement Number 2. Call us at 615-2603 or WhatsApp 704-2246 to get your quote. Car City Trading, quality products at unbeatable prices. Welcome to eFix Investments Limited, your one-stop destination for all your home essentials. Transform your bathroom with our exquisite range of showers, enclosures, luxury bathtubs, modern toilets, faucets, ceramic sinks, and vanities. Enhance your kitchen with our stainless steel sinks. Our extensive selection include bath, kitchen accessories, as well as security doors. Visit our showroom today at Southern Main Road, Homeland Gardens, Knupia, and let your dream home become a reality. Call us at 665-2282 or 671-2282. eFix Investments Limited, your home, your style, our passion. Just got your CXC OK results? Then start your degree today at CTS College and choose from many of our pathways in business management, business administration, human resource management, marketing, finance, management information systems, computer engineering, computing and information systems. Full and partial scholarships are available. CTS College, where education is beyond academics. PNV Marketing is number one for all your new and roll-on roll-off vehicles. 100% financing available on all vehicles. The best price and warranty for three years or 50,000 kilometers. Seven years warranty or 100,000 kilometers on hybrid batteries. Visit our showroom or give us a call today. Are you embarrassed by excessive hair loss, itchy flaky scalp, receding hairline, teenage and adult cystic acne, open pores, old scar marks, puffy dark eye circles, age spots, black lips, psoriasis, eczema or dermatitis? Do you want to get rid of deep lines and wrinkles, stretch marks, cellulite and discoloration around the neck, arms and between the legs? For a professional consultation and a microscopic analysis with Ms. Bagan, who has over 30 years of experience, call 673-7418 now. We are professionals in general construction, paving, asphalt services and preparation of residential and commercial developments. At Liqua Construction Services Limited, our team of professionals has the knowledge, experience and resources to make your projects run smoothly, on time, on budget. We supply red sand, gravel, oil sand and more. Equipment rental available, 20-ton excavators, mini excavators, Excavators, porter cool, bulldozers, concrete pumps, and so much more. Contact us today for a free site visit and quote. Neo Eyewear presents its latest designer eyewear collection. Come in and see our new arrivals of Versace, George Armani, Michael Kors, Coach, Ray-Ban, Kate Spade, Fossil, Marc Jacobs, Boss, DKNY, Nine West, and much more. Call us at 390-3196 or 672-5052. Find us on Facebook. We carry one of the largest selection of spectacle frames in the country, over 1,300 frames to choose from. Secret. Your place always so clean and organized. <laughs> well, girl, I've got a secret. It's Sir. Sir? Seriously? You have a man coming to clean? No, girl. Sir's an amazing new line of cleaning products. I'm talking about kitchen sprays, bathroom scrubs, even laundry detergent. They've got the whole house covered. So your secret weapon is Sir? You bet. Sir cleaning products are a game changer. Not only do they smell amazing, they're effective and affordable. And this Sir definitely wouldn't judge your mess. <laughs> <laughs> Introducing the Sir Collection, a wide range of affordable cleaning essentials for every corner of your home. Discover the secret to a clean home. Available at all leading supermarkets nationwide. 
At Army Hardware and Superstore Company Limited, we make hardware shopping a lot easier and affordable. We have everything from foundation to finish, new wave or are using circular deck and pan, pre-painted PVDF, VRC grade 1 red blocks, eco cement, corrugated or smooth steel and so much more. Approved by the Trinidad and Tobago Bureau of Standards. Come in to any of our two locations, Derek Roches Village or Royal Road Aruka. Give us a call at 671-3001 or 692-3629 or WhatsApp 384-25304 quotations. Matai Imports Limited, the number one pickup shop for the best quality, price, and service. Check out their showroom at number 750 Papery Road, Lower Barrapore for a wide variety of 4x4 SUV and car accessories. You name it, they have it. Matai Imports has all the latest items in the market. The 4x4 boss is always taking you to the next level in the automotive industry. So contact them today at 654-5234 or 360-8773 for further information. With the brand new Passage One Card, earning points is as easy as shopping at any Passage Booking supermarket, Bright Ideas and Crave. And let me show you how easy it is to redeem points. You can redeem your points when you shop for new curtains, household items, decor, flowers, and seasonal items at Bright Ideas. You can enjoy discounts at our loyalty partners. Yarrow Family Medicine Pharmacy with 10% off every $100 spent. Occumed Health, Safety and Wellness for discounts up to 10% on your doctor's visit. 11th Avenue Doctor's Office for 10% off your first visit. Dr. Rampol's Family Practice for 10% off your visit. Plus, Guardian Life of the Caribbean for 5% off for new customers. SNS Passage Supermarket comes to St. Mary's Freeport with the wide eyes of variety, quality you can trust, a community hub, and royalty rewards. When I say that have everything, that have everything from your fresh produce, the wines and spirit, your butcher, meat, seafood, bakery, you need it, they have it. And with these prices, trust me, they're guaranteed to save some money in your pocket. So come on down and shop the day at the brand new SNS Passage Supermarket, St. Mary's Free Food. Attention all bakers, double spenders, and roti makers. Try our high-quality pro-made free, all-purpose, and whole wheat flour. Low price and conveniently packaged in 2 pounds, 2 kg, 10 kg, and 25 kg bags. For wholesale and retail prices, contact Chiquicho Limited at 665-3336 or 4808715. Or visit us at Warrenville Canopia, Chiquicho Limited. Quality you can trust. Sukai's Diesel Service brings you outstanding and exceptional quality. We carry original parts, diesel pump and injector overhaul, diesel pump and injector testing, machine shop services, complete diesel engine overhaul, engine dyno testing, turbocharger repairs, government approved vehicle inspection station one. We are the premier source of all things diesel. Call us today for an appointment at 671-0900. If it's diesel, it's Sukai's Diesel. Diabetic, pre-diabetic, or at risk for diabetes? You need Berberine Plus by Aja Nutrition. Two doses a day keeps the blood sugar at bay, cholesterol levels in check, and your immune system strong. Made with ancient Ayurvedic ingredients, Berberine, bitter melon, and banana leaf, Berberine Plus is clinically proven to improve glucose metabolism, enhance insulin sensitivity, and slows glucose absorption in the gut. Berberine Plus, providing a natural path to a healthier you. Pick up a bottle today at Pennywise and all leading pharmacies nationwide. 
Adres Marketing Limited, the Caribbean's largest supplier of wrought iron parts and accessories. We carry a wide selection of handcrafted decorative security steel doors, UPVC and aluminum windows, zinc RHS, gate tracks, hinges, razor spikes and welding equipment. Come see our stainless steel department where we cater for domestic and commercial use. Visit us today at Freeport and Arapita Avenue for your beautification and security needs. Don't wait until it's too late. Total Tools One Stop Station by Salinas Marketing is the number one authorized distributor for original Total Tools products in the Caribbean. We carry a wide variety of quality products suited for any project or everyday use. Pressure washers, rotary hammers, cordless drills, angle grinders, chop saws, vacuums, ladders, and so much more. Come in to 797 to 799 Parkery Road, Lower Barrack Pole, and be amazed by our fantastic prices. Contact us at 654-5996 or 3678-665. Follow us on Facebook and Instagram for great deals. Welcome to Bobby's Motor Supplies and Accessories Limited, your number one dealer in auto parts. We carry a wide range of windshields, door glass, body parts, auto lamps, lenses, batteries, suspension parts, and much more. Come on down to a one of a kind showroom at Hussein Circular Drive Number Two Bamboo Settlement for your side steps, bed liner, chrome kits, roll bar, tray covers with free installation on all accessories. Call us at 235-4859 or WhatsApp 342-3453. Our friendly customer service staff is ready to assist you. Adrian's Marketing Home Improvement Center has it all. Get your household items, bathroom accessories, vanities, shower enclosures, patio furniture, dining sets, small appliances and so much more. Visit us today for the best deals. Come home to quality at Adrian's Marketing Home Improvement Center. Just in time for Eid, the Fab India Expo opposite Medford Gas Station in Shagwanas will be reopening on the 9th of March. We've got unique items available, one-of-a-kind outfits for the entire family for Eid. We've got a wide range of gift items also available for the month of Ramadan. Join us for Iftar every day. We've got multiple booths catering for your religious needs. Also catering the best grooms and bridal outfits with matching accessories and all that you need. Check out our multi-cuisine food court and nano school fee. We've got a wide range of modern furniture available, pure furniture and so much more. The Fab India Expo opposite Medford Gas Station, Shagornas from the 9th of March. Be sure to check us out. Enhance the space with Extreme Home and Tile Supplying Limited. Get porcelain and ceramic tiles, decorative security doors, toilet sets, face basins, and more. Visit us at Perseverance Road Chase Village Corners or call 299-327. Make this Ramadan unforgettable with Facades the Food King. Share joyful meals with loved ones with our wide selection of quality ingredients. Enjoy Central Farms Halal Duck, £4.89. Dujardin Frozen Veg Mix, 454 grams, 2 for $24.99. Fine Choice Calypso Pack Chicken, two packs, $20. Crown Powerball Rice, 8 kgs, $59.99. Distinction Milk, two packs, $27. Regal Dates, 175 grams, two packs for $14.99. Fresh Harvest, 750 gram brown sugar, three packs for $25. Nutrimix Flour, 10 kg, now $74.99. Split Piece Dal, 400 grams, five packs for $20. Plus, Fresh Harvest, one gallon soybean oil for only $54.99. Offers available at all nine locations until April 10th or while stocks last. Wishing you a blessed Ramadan from Passage the Food King. Head on down to Gibbons Auto Parts with a March Madness sale. For the month of March, you can get fantastic prices on Japanese-made and roll-on roll-on vehicles, Nissan, Toyota, Mitsubishi, and more. Steering racks, nose cut, bumpers, evaporators, condensers, alternators, compressors, coil packs, fenders, bonnets, transmission, mirrors, head and tail lamps, and so much more. Visit any of our three locations, Bamboo Number no. 2, Bamboo Number no. 3, and Aruka. Give us a call or check us out on social media. It's a March Madness sale now on at Dibbles Auto Parts. Dibbles Auto Parts, we lead others follow. Health is not a sprint, it's a marathon, Jen. You know that. You got this. Nutrients for immune system support, heart health, and energy metabolism. But remember, you have more than regular energy. It's Jennifer Lopez energy. Or J-Lo energy. Seems forced. Jenny from the block energy. Overdone. Pick up a bottle today at Pennywise and all leading pharmacies nationwide. 
Thai Clinic has its big rim sale on. Get 20 to 50% off on the latest styles and sizes. We carry a variety of tires and tie equipments for agriculture and industrial needs at the best prices. Located at Kuva Shigonas and Pleasance Park, the Thai Clinic is tire for every need. There's a jungle out. There's a there's a there's a jungle out. Crying out loud. There's a there's a jungle out there and the hunt is on. A jungle out there and the hunt is on. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna come. We ain't playing. It's the last thing on our minds. Stop crying much if you really really wanna stop crying. Be safe when you're home. Be safe when you're street. It's a cold place and I'm really feeling the heat. I never wear gold cause summer's always beeping by the fence. Still crying much came and give TNT confidence. I had a dream in the dark. I had a dream in the spring. I had a dream. I had a dream like my new day. There's a jungle out there and the hunt is on. A jungle out there and the hunt is on. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna hunt you down. There's a jungle out. There's a there's a there's a jungle out. Crying out loud. There's a there's a jungle out there and the hunt is on. A jungle out there and the hunt is on. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna come. We ain't playing. It's the last thing on our minds. Stop crying much if you really really wanna stop crying. Be safe when you're home. Be safe when you're street. It's a cold place and I'm really feeling the heat. I never wear gold cause summer's always beeping by the fence. I still cry much. Came and give TNT confidence. I had a dream in the dark. I had a dream in the spring. I had a dream. I had a dream like my new day. There's a jungle out there and the hunt is on. A jungle out there and the hunt is on. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna hunt you down. There's a jungle out. There's a there's a there's a jungle out. Crying out loud. There's a there's a jungle out there and the hunt is on. A jungle out there and the hunt is on. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna come. We ain't playing. It's the last thing on our minds. Stop crying much if you really really wanna stop crying. Be safe when you're home. Be safe when you're street. It's a cold place and I'm really feeling the heat. I never wear gold 'cause summer's always beeping by the fence. Still crying much. Came and give TNT confidence. I had a dream in the dark. I had a dream in the spring. I had a dream. I had a dream like my new day. There's a jungle out there and the hunt is on. A jungle out there and the hunt is on. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna hunt you down. There's a jungle out. There's a there's a there's a jungle out. Crying out loud. There's a there's a jungle out there and the hunt is on. A jungle out there and the hunt is on. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna come. We ain't playing. It's the last thing on our minds. Stop crying much if you really really wanna stop crying. Be safe when you're home. Be safe when you're street. It's a cold place and I'm really feeling the heat. I never wear gold 'cause summer's always beeping by the fence. Still crying much. Came and give TNT confidence. I had a dream in the dark. I had a dream in the spring. I had a dream. I had a dream like my new day. There's a jungle out there and the hunt is on. A jungle out there and the hunt is on. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna hunt you down. There's a jungle out. There's a there's a there's a jungle out. Crying out loud. There's a there's a jungle out there and the hunt is on. A jungle out there and the hunt is on. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna come. We ain't playing. It's the last thing on our minds. Stop crying much if you really really wanna stop crying. Be safe when you're home. Be safe when you're street. It's a cold place and I'm really feeling the heat. I never wear gold 'cause summer's always beeping by the fence. I still crying much. Came and give TNT confidence. I had a dream in the dark. I had a dream in the spring. I had a dream. I had a dream like my new day. There's a jungle out there and the hunt is on. A jungle out there and the hunt is on. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna hunt you down. There's a jungle out. There's a there's a there's a jungle out. Crying out loud. There's a there's a jungle out there and the hunt is on. A jungle out there and the hunt is on. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna come. We ain't playing. It's the last thing on our minds. Stop crying much if you really really wanna stop crying. Be safe when you're home. Be safe when you're street. It's a cold place and I'm really feeling the heat. I never wear gold 'cause summer's always beeping by the fence. Still crying much. Came and give TNT confidence. I had a dream in the dark. I had a dream in the spring. I had a dream. I had a dream like my new day. There's a jungle out there and the hunt is on. A jungle out there and the hunt is on. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna hunt you down. 
out. There's a jungle out. There's a there's a there's a jungle out. Yeah, there's, 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 there's a jungle out there and the hunt is on. A jungle out there and the hunt is on. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna come win playing, it's the last thing on our mind Stop crying much if you really, really wanna stop crying Be safe when you're home, be safe in the streets It's a cold place and I'm nearly feeling the heat I never wear gold cause someone's always peeping by the fence I still cry much, came and give TNT confidence I had a dream in the dark, I had a dream in the spring I had a dream, I had a dream like my new There's king. a jungle out there and the hunt is on A jungle out there and the hunt is on We're gonna hunt you down, we're gonna hunt you down there's a jungle out. There's a there's a there's a jungle out. There's a there's a jungle out there and the hunt is on. A jungle out there and the hunt is on. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna come win playing. It's the last thing on our mind. Stop crying much if you really really wanna stop crying. Be safe when you're home. Be safe in the streets. It's a cold place and I'm nearly feeling the heat. I never wear gold cause someone's always peeping by the fence. I still cry much. Came and give TNT confidence. I had a dream in the dark. I had a dream in the spring. I had a dream. I had a dream like my new day. There's a jungle out there and the hunt is on. A jungle out there and the hunt is on. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna hunt you down. There's a jungle out. There's a there's a there's a jungle out. There's a there's a jungle out there and the hunt is on. A jungle out there and the hunt is on. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna come win playing. It's the last thing on our mind. Stop crying much if you really really wanna stop crying. Be safe when you're home. Be safe in the streets. It's a cold place and I'm nearly feeling the heat. I never wear gold cause someone's always peeping by the fence. I still cry much. Came and give TNT confidence. I had a dream in the dark. I had a dream in the spring. I had a dream. I had a dream like my new day. There's a jungle out there and the hunt is on. A jungle out there and the hunt is on. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna hunt you down. There's a jungle out. There's a there's a there's a jungle out. There's a there's a jungle out there and the hunt is on. A jungle out there and the hunt is on. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna come win playing. It's the last thing on our mind. Stop crying much if you really really wanna stop crying. Be safe when you're home. Be safe in the streets. It's a cold place and I'm nearly feeling the heat. I never wear gold cause someone's always peeping by the fence. I still cry much. Came and give TNT confidence. I had a dream in the dark. I had a dream in the spring. I had a dream. I had a dream like my new day. There's a jungle out there and the hunt is on. A jungle out there and the hunt is on. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna hunt you down. There's a jungle out. There's a there's a there's a jungle out. There's a there's a jungle out there and the hunt is on. A jungle out there and the hunt is on. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna come win playing. It's the last thing on our mind. Stop crying much if you really really wanna stop crying. Be safe when you're home. Be safe in the streets. It's a cold place and I'm nearly feeling the heat. I never wear gold cause someone's always peeping by the fence. I still cry much. Came and give TNT confidence. I had a dream in the dark. I had a dream in the spring. I had a dream. I had a dream like my new day. There's a jungle out there and the hunt is on. A jungle out there and the hunt is on. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna hunt you down. There's a jungle out. There's a there's a there's a jungle out. There's a there's a jungle out there and the hunt is on. A jungle out there and the hunt is on. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna hunt you down. We're gonna come win playing. It's the last thing on our mind. Stop crying much if you really really wanna stop crying. Be safe when you're home. Be safe in the streets. It's a cold place and I'm nearly feeling the heat. I never wear gold cause someone's always peeping by the fence. I still cry much. Came and give TNT confidence. I had a dream in the dark. I had a dream in the spring. I had a dream. I had a dream like my new day. There's a jungle out there and the hunt is on. A jungle out there and the hunt is on. Hi, right, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. This is Ian Allen. This is Crime Watch, and we are back. Top of the evening to all those of you who are locked online. A special good evening to you also, ladies and gentlemen. Eid Mubarak to the Muslim community. And happy Navash, uh, happy 
Navatri to all our Hindu brothers and sisters. So it's a very auspicious time, an auspicious day for everybody. The, I see Shadow Shakti with some of my Muslim friends. Oh, they're all excited, some of our Hindu friends. So everybody was like, but it's another way to go because everybody, everybody going to temple, going to mosque, going, everybody just relaxing. And you know, it's, it's, it's such a great time to all those of you who are locked online, a special good evening to all those of you who are looking at me from all over the world, a special, special good evening to you. Well, ladies and gentlemen, again, those of you who are looking at me from all over the world in Trinidad, wherever you are on your phone, on your Android phone, on your iPhone, this is really, really, it, it is a sad day. It's a sad day for us here because I'm sure that you are aware, I am sure that you are aware that uh, uh, um, a child, a, a, a child, in fact, the nation has gone into mourning after a child, a, a, a four-year-old was decapitated last night. Last night I visited the scene. Today I spoke with the mother. Today I spoke with the mother and father, the biological father of the child. You, um, in fact, I'm going to start it first. Last night we were there when I got the call. I met senior superintendent and um, inspector um, Pierre. He was there also with senior superintendent Smith, my good friend. They spoke to me for a couple minutes. And ladies and gentlemen, so we have a very, very tight show today. But some of you want, want, want to know exactly what went on. So I tried to put it all in a nutshell for you today. So listen, listen and, well, at least you'll understand what exactly went on. You're going to hear from the father how he said that the, the courts, the courts of Trinidad and Tobago, the police, he made so many attempts to see his child. The last time he saw his child was three years ago. And it just goes on. The mother said, well, she been, in fact, I only found out, I only found out today that I know the mother because in, in 2020, I did a sister with a matter where she was being threatened and whatnot. And it was right in African grounds in, in, in Enterprise here. Yeah? And I did visit this scene, and you know, so many people across Trinidad and Tobago that I have touched and assisted them in some way, in some, some way. And I was so sad because I remembered her, I remembered her. So, ladies and gentlemen, last time we were there, so I'm trying my, I, I tried my best. In fact, just to let you know, the disease has been identified as uh, Amara Lalit, a four year old of Fifth Street, Five Rivers, Aruka, at about 10 10, Amara's mother went to Aruka police station, battered and disbelieved to make report of domestic violence between her, her and her boyfriend. She also informed the officers that the suspect take, took a had taken her child hostage. A team of officers led by Inspector P and Inspector Joshua subsequently went with the woman to the home where they made the gruesome discovery. Amara, Amara, uh, Amara's body was found in one room of the home while the, her head was found in a barrel. And, and I'm going to show you the barrel today, lady, in a blue barrel, in a blue barrel. And um, in fact, so just to let you know, just to let you know, ladies and gentlemen, that that this is really sad, and, and it all goes back. You'll hear what the mother said, and it's so true. You need parents out there, mothers out there, women out there. You need to know who you are putting in your lives. I mean, as I said, the late prime minister made a very profound statement when he said that politics has a morality of its own. And the late prime minister, Basri Pandey, said that. And and another statement that will live for generation, and we saw it today, is when Patrick and um, is when Dr. Keith Rowley said, "Choose your men wisely. You need to do that. You need to do that because someday you don't know. There are people who might display tendencies then, but when incidents happen, when the atmosphere starts to boil, you see the true nature of them. It's like when people get angry and they, they, they drink alcohol, you start to yes, you start to see a side of them that you have never seen before. And don't matter how long you've been living with them and sharing a relationship with them." There are things that will, that, that will bring out, that will bring out that, that personality that you might be shocked because the mother said in a, in a separate interview last night, the, today with me, she said, I never, ladies and gentlemen, I never imagined under this big blue sky that this man had that kind of tendency. He was very protective of the four-year-old. He never, you know, he was, he, well, he was a good stepfather. He was a good stepfather. I mean, I was a, a bit disappointed. I, well, I won't say disappointed, but I went, um, uh, we, got, we got an exclusive video. Someone sent me an exclusive video from inside. And I was, you know, like, social services, not doing anything. And even the mother told me, the mother of the four-year-old said, I went to social services. I went to, to get a little food card for my child, despite the challenges that we are living. 
and they blank me, they blank me. And sometimes these social welfare officers, I sometimes they, they, they sometimes feel that their money go, their their money you know, is their money. You know, it's not your money. There are people and families and and children who deserve social assistance, public public assistance and whatnot. And they are being denied every day, every day, every day. But it's a friend and family. Who gain card? You know? Who gain card? So, ladies and gentlemen, it's a 12 minutes video by 12 by 12. So, we're running tight today. So, ladies and gentlemen, Eid Mubarak again to the Muslim community. Happy Navratri for the to the Hindu community. And let's go to last night. Go ahead. So, ladies and gentlemen, this is Ian Allen. As you can see, the back of me here, this is where the four-year-old uh, was beheaded. Uh, and it's so sad because the they had to get the the, um, the child. The head was found in, in a barrel. The suspect is in custody. The mother, the mother is so distraught. She went to the police station when she came back. And what we are hearing, ladies and gentlemen, is that apparently he 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 he, he was placed out of out, out of the house a while and um, neighbors heard him chanting things and whatnot. There was an argument. I think three people live in this house here. And um, I'll try during the course of the day to get a better shot of the area for you. If, if the police officers are here, I got, in fact, I spoke with Senior Superintendent Smith and other, P, and Inspector P and everybody. And, but nevertheless, ladies and gentlemen, this is tragic. What kind of person will be head a four, a four year old child? He is in custody. I just spoke with Senior Superintendent Smith. I did a, in, um, he did an interview with me a short while ago with Inspector P and, um, Nevertheless, I mean, at least, you know, they got the suspects, the um, senior superintendent Smith got, and, and Inspector P and other officers were able to apprehend the suspects. So the investigation is ongoing. I don't want to say too much, but nevertheless, my heart really goes out to the neighborhood in, in, in Fifth Street, Aruka. Accept my sympathy. And um, I mean, I'm happy that, it, that you know, that you'll have the, the presence of a very, a very distinguished senior superintendent, a very hardworking senior superintendent. Hi, good night, sir. Um, good night, senior superintendent. How are you, sir? Good night. Tell me exactly what happened here tonight, sir. Well, tonight we are on the scene of a, a gruesome murder mm -hmm. that occurred at Fifth Street in mm -hmm. Five Rivers, Aruka. Uh -huh. And um, you know, it all started around 10, 10 p.m. where the informant went to the Aruka police station seeking assistance from the police to deal with a domestic situation that was occurring at the home at the time. Uh -huh. Um, upon um, her arrival at the police station, Aruka police station, she was accompanied by two officers. And upon their arrival at, the, at her home, they met a male relative who she left here with her four year old daughter. Her name is Amira Lilith. And um, whilst checking for the child, upon their arrival, she discovered the huh. body of the child in one of the bedrooms. And where is it? There was. The, the, the child was beheaded. Mm -hmm. um, the head could not be found. Upon the arrival of the CSI, when the process is seen, the head was eventually found nearby in a barrel of water. Now, um, we have the suspect, a male suspect in custody, mm -hmm. and um, inquiries are being continued by members of the Homicide Bureau Region 3. And this is your division, sir? So? Yes, this is the North Central Division of Ruka Police Station. I have with me Inspector Pierre from the Mr. Police Station. He is the inspector in charge of the Aruka mm -hmm. Police Station. Well, I'm happy to know the suspect is in custody. He's yes. ongoing investigation. So yes. I know you wouldn't be able to say any more again. Not, not, not like that. No, no. So thanks again, sir. You're Thank welcome. You again. Well, ladies and gentlemen. Condolences to the family. Uh -huh. yes. All right, so all the families involved. Yeah. Condolences. I, I, I spoke to a couple of the neighbors a while ago, and you know they were all saddened because of they know course. the child, they know the yes. mother. You know, but they themselves, you know, they were very cautious. But to say anything but everybody's sad and the entire yes. area has gone into mourning yes. about this child you understand apparently people know the child they know the mother and everything so again we can't sit i want to say not more suspect you know it is alleged as as they say you know but um it's very very unfortunate but then we're looking at the level of violence we have in this society now uh -huh. yeah and this is where is this is this progress or regress it's true where are we where are we really going now true what can a four-year-old child do where are we going how can the police police this? 
in all your years as a, as, as a police officer, we started from a corporal, now no, no reaching to a, a senior superintendent. Is this the worst level of crime you've ever witnessed in your entire career? Well, it's one of the worst because I, I you know, I was on the, the scene of a, a beheading as well, or uh -huh. a mother and child in the Southland uh, many years many ago. Many years ago, yeah, uh -huh. yeah. I remember. Uh -huh. uh, yeah, so, um, you know, it, it, it's one of the worst, you know, and um, whenever a child... We, we, we are hurt by each murder, but then when you have a child involved, a four-year-old yes, child, yes, you know, yes, you yes. look at the innocence and all these things. You know, where are we really going? You know, are we really civilized as, as we would tend to believe? Where are we going? Like I said, you just have to keep pursuing the criminal exactly. elements relentlessly and to. start and smoke them out from the from, from, from their dark holes. Exactly. And I must say that you've been doing well. You've been doing well. Exactly. I mean, how much, I mean, I can't blame you for the situation, but... In, I mean, the areas that you have gone, you have done so so much in South. South is the, you know, you're, you're, you're left at you know, you know, you know, you are here. And um, as much as, you know, you're doing well, you're doing well. So okay. I know this area will see uh, uh, in the coming, you know, in the future, okay. they will see a reduction with your presence. And, of course, you know, I'm here. here. Uh, my inspectors and other Inspector members of the here, Central yeah. Division. Assisting in that. That is nice for you to come yes. out tonight, and you know, of course, it's not very, it's, it's not often you see a senior so on a on a crime scene. It's already morning, eh? Well, because it's approximately two o'clock in the morning. Yes. You know, and this says a lot. When you take calls, you have to be uh, dedicated. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, sir. All right, gentlemen. Thanks again. Thank you. Okay, Perfect, you again. thank you. Well, ladies and gentlemen, you heard it from the seniors that you know exactly what transpired here, and it's very, very unfortunate. The place is dark, but this is the house across here. So, ladies and gentlemen, so ladies and gentlemen, we just decided we, we just chatting with a neighbor here. So she have declined to go on camera because she's so distraught. She know, she know the mother, she know the child. In fact, the mother is a close friend. What exactly happened at Fifth Street today? Tell me. My mother was going to the back of the house to get the dog uh -huh. to bring him to the front, and she heard some commotion going on. She came in the front and told me, and then I went to the back and I was listening to hear what was going on mm -hmm. and I was seeing him chanting some kind of madness and um, then the desert kind of silence uh -huh. and then when I turned my back I hear a scream uh -huh. I ran back to the back and I called out her name Trisha uh -huh. then I went back to the front to get my jacket uh -huh. and my glasses and I came up straight here to her home and I saw her running towards me telling me that he beheaded her child Telling you that she that, that he beheaded her child. Okay. Okay. And then she ran to the police station. She ran to the police station before. Uh-huh. So by the time I called the police and stuff and the police came. came here, she was already here. Like. Wow, you called the police. Wow, but knowing her as your good friend, did did you did you know that if if she, if she had, or apparently he was a paranoid kind of man? Yeah, he was paranoid. He, he, he never used to let her go no way. He never used to let her talk to nobody. But he was a he handy man in the isolate area. Her. He tried to isolate her. Mm. But he was supposed to send that child for, to school on sometime in September. in September. But then I realized that he's not the father of the child. He's, somebody was telling me that the father left St. Joseph or something like that. Yeah. And from what I heard is that the father is <laughs> not even aware because the father would have been down here already. Mm. Wow. But but I, I was saying I mean the child was the, the child is a display very I mean symptoms strange that that, that behavior. strange behavior like maybe how, how because how long he been living with your friend? Um, probably when the child was not a year yet I believe. Probably and the child is four yeah. And but she's four. She'll be five in September. But she but the mother always had a fear for the man. I wouldn't say fear. I think of recent I wasn't seeing her as much because uh -huh. usually I would um give her stuff and things to help uh -huh, her out. Uh -huh, uh -huh. And I wasn't seeing her as much as I would usually see her. Uh -huh. So I didn't take nothing of it. I just thought that everything okay and she financially okay and she didn't need anything. Uh -huh. That's why I probably wasn't seeing her. And but the man didn't want her to work. No, he didn't want her to work. But she has another child. An elder daughter. An elder daughter. The elder father. daughter lives here? No, she lives with her father. So just the mother and the little girl and this man? And this man, yeah. Wow. But again, again, you saved the mother and all too because, you know, how you got involved and calling the police and, you know. Well, she actually ran out. She, she ran out. He was trying to grab her back he to the house. He was trying to, yeah. That's what she but told me. But did he ever display that kind of 
That kind of violent, violent tendency. He was kind of that type of aggression. He was kind of that. aggressive. And and he was aggressive. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah, he was always aggressive. So but you never paranoid witnessed, as yeah. Anything. Never no physical anything, no hitting. She never mentioned anything like hitting or anything. So being know. a handyman, he will have all kind of couplers walking all up and down yeah, the road. Yeah, I don't know about that. Walkers and whatnot, are they? I never see that. I don't be outside. Yeah, like yeah. That. yeah. But um, I know he just do this internet connection to the phones and thing. And, um, yeah. That's all I know about. Nothing else. So you don't come out and interact with the neighborhood and I whatnot? I don't come out. He so don't I come don't. out? He don't, he, he, I don't, he don't see don't. him in the road or anything. What's his name? Isan Kontan. Isan? Kontan. Okay. Kontan. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. But he has any nickname in the area? Yeah, he's, um, he's, he's about, he's, like but somebody said he's about 30, about 20, he's going to 30, 30, somewhere around there. Yeah? Yeah, I'm not sure of the age, but I know probably early 30s. Early 30s. And his family lives around here? No. He's well, from Mount Lambert. He's from Mount Lambert. Mm -hmm. He's San Content. Wow. So you never imagine something like this would happen to your friend, huh? No. That's like a dream. Wow. Well, I'll just, you know, tell you to be strong and, you know, to the neighbor. I can imagine like, everybody is just sad about this thing. This has really, because tomorrow here will be buzzing with media, with this one, with that one. Police going back to the house and whatnot to see what's going on, mm -hmm. you know. But it's really very, it's very, very sad. So, thanks again. Thank you again. Well, ladies and gentlemen, okay. stay right here. This, I, was just, I was just chatting with uh, someone who know the mother okay. well and a, a, a close friend and, you heard it from us, it's very, very tragic. And it's a wake up call. You really have to know who you're bringing in your Around life, your right? Children. You really, you, you, you heard her? You really have to know who you bring, who you're going to get involved with. I mean, if you and somebody, if you and your husband break up, you have to be careful. You don't know who you're bringing, what kind of tendencies they have. You understand? This is just crazy. This is, I mean, this is, this is, a, this is like a monster. Who will be here? A, a, a four year old child. Thank you again. Hi. Hi. Smile. Yay. What are you doing? You know, ladies and gentlemen, before we, we before we take that prayer and observe for, for um, the Muslim community before they break fast, we have two minutes again, and I just wanted to hear from you. I mean, I'm just looking at the videos, some of the, the clips with the kid, with, 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 with the four-year-old. I mean, it is really, really sad. Am Amara, really, really sad. I'm just going to show it to you before we take that break. Open up the lines to me by time. Hi, caller. Good evening. Your life on crime watch. Also, I have two murders to tell you about. Go ahead. Hi, caller. Good evening. These, these, these are some of the photos in better, in, in happier times. These are the videos. Really, really sad. Really, really sad. Remember, ladies and gentlemen, all those of you who are looking at me from Ian Allen Network on YouTube and Ian Allen Network on Facebook, and those of you around the world that are looking, and those of those Hindus that are observing, happy uh, uh Navatri, happy Navatri to you and also Eid Mubarak to the Muslim community. It's such a, you know, it's such a, we just have to be strong and we just have to be strong, ladies and gentlemen. To the, and just the fact that I visited this scene. Hi, caller, good evening. You're live on Crime Watch. Hi, Hi good evening. Hi, good evening. Go ahead. Mr. Allen, this is real painful as a mother to digest huh. that what could really come into a human being to do this nice little innocent child act. Yeah. and then people would say this person mad but they have to have a justice and a law for these type of things yeah, yeah. how could somebody do this Miss Allen? this is madness behead this little 
Angel, this is craziness. But on another note, Mr. Allen, you look really good this evening. You look really, really handsome. I love your outfit. Okay, what about my girlfriend? No, I know, I know you. I'll have competitors because a lot of ladies again. love you. <laughs> right, thank you again. <laughs> Hi, Cola. Good evening. You're live on Crime Watch. Hi, Cola. Good evening. You're live on Crime Watch. Hi, Cola. Good evening. You're live on Crime Watch. I'm showing videos, ladies and gentlemen. Hi, Cola. M Mr. Allen, good uh, evening. Yeah. You look ravishing. Apart from the sadness we have to endure this evening from that monster. But the sad thing about it is when you see they go to court, they're sending them in the mental institution. Uh -huh. And then you don't hear anything again about them. Just as he beheaded that child... They held his behind. They should be head here tomorrow in Woodford Square. Yeah, girl. Case done, talk done. Hang them high. They have to you get understand? hung. They have to get hung. Hang them high. All those of the... I never tell us something. Come back to me. It is a waste. Just so it is a lot to drive under. It, it, it is a charge to drive with an expired driver's permit. It is a charge to drive under the influence of alcohol. All those who have exhausted their legal options and forget and... and and Privy Council and the CCJ, hang them high. You have to hang them high, but where's the key back? Because taxpayers, you commit your crime. Nobody didn't tell you to do that. Some of you plan your business well. Hang them high. We're going to come out of and hang them high. You have to hang them high. Even the mother in an interview I did today with her. These are exclusive, you know, exclusive, ladies and gentlemen. When we come back, let's say the Courtesy break. Courtesy of Adris Marketing Limited. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Allahumma laqasumtu wa ala rizqika aftartu. Wala, for thy sake have I fasted, and I now break the fast with the sustenance that comes from thee. Bismillahi wa ala barakatala. Adrian's Marketing Home Improvement Center has it all. Get your household items, bathroom accessories, vanities, shower enclosures, patio furniture, dining sets, small appliances and so much more. Visit us today for the best deals. Come home to quality at Adrian's Marketing Home Improvement Center. Courtesy of Adrian's Marketing Limited. Wishing you a blessed Ramadan. Give the gift of food with a family in need. Available in store at 150, 200, 300, and 400 dollar food bags. Enjoy savings all month with Ramadan specials. Get small gala apples 10 for 20, carrots 3 packs for 20, ravi dates 500 grams 25 dollars, Ovaltine biscuits 6 for 20, chana 3 pounds for 20, raisin and sultanas 2 pounds for 20, 4z vermicelli 200 gram 4 for 20, happy condensed milk 2 for 20, regal almonds 50 grams 3 for 20, Nestle's full cream milk buy 3 get free carnation 40 dollars. This Eid you have the chance to win one of 12 shopping vouchers. Participate by spending $300 or more and submitting your entry into one of the designated entry boxes at any SNS Passage Supermarket stores. Promotion runs until April 10, 2024. Four convenient locations, Rio Claro, Mayaro and Freeport. SNS Passage Supermarket, loyal to local. Total Tools One Stop Station by Salinas Marketing is the number one authorized distributor for original Total Tools products in the Caribbean. We carry a wide variety of quality products suited for any project or everyday use. Pressure washer rotary hammers, cordless drills, angle grinders, chop saws, vacuums, ladders, and so much more. Come in to 797 to 799 Papery Road, Lower Barrack Pole, and be amazed by our fantastic prices. Contact us at 654-5996 or 3678-665. Follow us on Facebook and Instagram for great deals.
Go live with Ian Allen and let the world take notice of your business. Be seen by millions on all our platforms, Facebook, YouTube, our iOS and Android applications, and website, ianallen.org. Our network showcases you to viewers locally, regionally, and internationally. You'll be seen by millions. In 2023 so far, we've already crossed millions and counting. Our iOS and Android downloads have surpassed the 100,000s. Since 2016 to present, over 47 million people have viewed our videos. That is proof of our reach worldwide. No other network can outdo our proven performance. No one can beat us. Your live will stay on all our platforms indefinitely. You'll even own the rights to the production. Let Ian Allen transform your business and take it to a place you never thought possible. Call us today to book your spot. The millions are waiting. Daisy's Exclusive is having a massive three-in-one sale just in time for Easter, Spiritual Shelter Baptist and Eve. Get huge discounts store-wide on ready-made kits and panels, all fabrics, comforters, sheet sets, tablecloths and much more. Visit us in store, Chicorners and Pennywise Plaza. Introducing Berberine Plus by Aja Nutrition. Berberine Plus is formulated with berberine, bitter melon, and banana leaf to provide diabetic support, lower cholesterol, and support weight loss. It also supports PCOS and other metabolic conditions, which can contribute to diabetes, obesity, and insulin resistance. Available at Pennywise and leading pharmacies nationwide. Thinking of giving your home that modern finish? Then visit ABC Bar Doors and Windows. We are the largest supplier of hardwood finishing goods. Get kitchen and pool tiles, faucets, doors, windows, sinks, and so much more. Come in or give us a call. ABC Bar Doors and Windows, always a better choice. Is your business or company not making money? That's because no one knows about you. Advertise on Prime Watch, the number one show, and watch your business transform. Call us at 294-4081-225-4327 or 225-3250. Welcome to M6 Plaza, the newest shopping destination in Chicones, ideally located between Extra Foods and Pennywise Plaza. Shop from our many stores, the best toys, new eyewear, the beauty guild, aesthetics, Miguel Moses, JD's exclusive, Boise's and Tunisia's fashion glam, Indigo Blue, Strawberry Girls, Kid Zone, Wonderful World, Amazon Arts and Crafts, Sporty Brands, and Dr. Berry. All food and drinks at the Caesars, Green Bowl, DPK, Creek, Church's Chicken, Food Court, and much more. Come, shop, dine, and relax at M6 Plaza. Are you ready to elevate your home this evening? Then look no further. Our exclusive eat sale is here to transform your space into a masterpiece. Ceramic 18 by 18 floor tiles from 9.95. Ceramic wall tiles from 12.95. Porcelain 24 by 24 floor tiles from 32.95. Specials on granite and quartz countertops and much more. Whether you're renovating your kitchen, bathroom, or living room, our premium tiles provide durability and style at unbeatable prices. Don't miss out on these limited time offers. Visit our showroom today. Eat and Barak from the management and staff of Classic Tiles Limited. Just in time for Eid, the Fab India Expo opposite Medford Gas Station in Shagwanas will be reopening on the 9th of March. We've got unique items available, one-of-a-kind outfits for the entire family for Eid. We've got a wide range of gift items also available for the month of Ramadan. Join us for Iftar every day. We've got multiple boots catering for your religious needs. Also catering the best grooms and bridal outfits with matching accessories and all that you need. Check out our multi-cuisine food court and nano school fee. We've got a wide range of modern furniture available, pure teak furniture and so much more. The Fab India Expo opposite Medford Gas Station, Shagornas from the 9th of March. Be sure to check us out. Make this Ramadan unforgettable with Prasad's The Food King. Share joyful meals with loved ones with our wide selection of quality ingredients. Enjoy Halal Bone Goat per pound, now $21.99. Central Farm Duck, 3.5 pounds to 4 pounds, just $99. Du Jardin Frozen Veg Mix, 4.54 grams, 2 packs for $24.99. Fine Choice Calypso Pack Chicken, 2 packs for $20. Plus, more deals at Prasad's The Food King on Crown Parboiled Rice, 1 kg, 3 packs. 
packs for $25. Distinction Milk, two packs for $27. Regal Dates, 175 grams, two packs for $14.99. Even more savings at Passage de Food King on Fresh Harvest, 750 gram brown sugar, three packs for $25. Nutramix Flour, 10 kg is now $74.99. Plus Fresh Harvest, one gallon soya bean oil for only $54.99. Hurry, offer available at all nine locations till April 10th or while stocks last. Wishing you a blessed Ramadan from Passat, the food king. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I mean, this, I, I, I can't describe this. I just can't describe this today. Also, when, when I left here last, and in fact, two o'clock, I spoke to senior superintendent. We spoke to our neighbor. Today, I went back on the scene. I went back on the scene. And I spoke with the mother. Now, listen to what the mother has to say. And just as I said, it's decisions. The audio, we, we had a little problem with the audio, but this is exclusive. I spoke to the mother of the four-year-old today. Go ahead. When was the last time you saw your child? Um, last night, about, uh -huh. about nine, uh -huh. nine to three. About nine to three? She was, yeah, she was happy. She was on her tab, uh -huh. playing her games, you yeah. uh -huh. When it is um, when I enter the the, the, the room, when I actually I knock yes, on the door, right. and I knocked on the door uh -huh. to enter uh -huh. one of the rooms so he could let me in, right? Uh -huh. And when he opened the door, he pushed me out of the room and then he grabbed me by my neck and my t-shirt uh -huh. to drag me in the room like he wanted to harm me, uh -huh. right? Um. I managed to escape. While I was trying to escape, I was calling Amara to come. Amara, come. Mm -hmm. Amara did not move. Amara was on the bed playing and laughing. And like if I so how long was you started Amara. between both of you? It, it, he, he was normal all the time. He just started to display like 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 multiple personalities. Just so, like just a couple of days. And the thing is with that, he, the questions he would ask. He has any history of displaying them kind of tendencies? No, this is the first time. He was never was aggressive. I went to St. Joseph's College. Um, the, this, this, yeah. this, 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 this incident, this is the first time. This is the first time he ever acted out like that. He was never a violent or aggressive person towards me or Amara. He would have, he was very protective actually. He was very, very protective of us, especially, especially... And how long have you been with him? Four years. Four years. How long you separated from your bio the, the child biological father? Amara was a year old when but I But you all good to all the good. You're the father, child yeah, father. Yeah, well, we, we talked, but we, we were not... We didn't, we, we didn't used to yeah. see each other regular because I had some things going on with mm, me yeah. where I wasn't able to be around. Mm -hmm. So, you know, we couldn't see each other at um, he couldn't get to see Amara at that time. But when I came back home, I didn't have a phone. I get a new phone. I couldn't call him to tell him anything. So, you know, we just kind of lose contact now, right? Mm -hmm. But the incident with, 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 with Amara is that the person that did it, he never used to show any violent tendencies. He just started to act. Like he had a sub different personality, he started asking outrageous questions, questions that didn't make any sense. So the dean question, which, 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 which is this morning, the, the, this morning, he, he started to, to, to act violently towards you and you ran. This morning, no, that was last, last night. Last night, sorry. I wasn't, he wasn't violent, you know, he was, he was asked, he was in, insinuating that I doing things like, he was scrutinizing her blood people. Mm -hmm and saying things like why his name not on her big people mm -hmm. why it have different names on her big people mm -hmm. you know? but he with you four years now he with me four years uh does not have he know he know What are you doing? So I trying to explain to the man, this, you know Amara is not yours. Why is it you acting up like this? So this man so never showed this kind like of tendency because he said he was very, he, he was protected. Uh, 
when he started show these tendencies i was in disbelief that it was real i swear mm-hmm. this man faking me out you know mm-hmm. because it was so outrageous and it it happened so sudden that i was i was in shock i didn't know what to think so i think and i could probably just talk to him and he might snap back but he just keeps showing the tendencies of I don't know, like, he was starting to lose it, I guess. Oh, where you got the blade from? Well, we, we have a cut, cut glass in the house from, yeah. and knives and all of that, so he probably get it from inside. So, you weren't there when he chopped the child? No. I, well, when I escaped yeah. from his grip, yeah. I ran down into the police station. Yeah, because the police station is just about a couple of minutes from here. Yeah, so when yeah. I reached down in the station, now I must probably wait about a 10 minutes before we come back up the road. Yeah. And when I came back with the cops, You saw, you saw the body? Well, I asked one of the officers when they already, when they detained him. Uh-huh. I asked one of the officers if I could go and check on my daughter and they allowed me to go inside. And when I walked in, as I stepped in the room, You saw the child's body? No, I didn't see her body initially as I walked in. I saw blood on the mm-hmm. floor, speared on the floor and on mm-hmm. the walls. And when I looked into the other room, that's when I saw my daughter on the ground, lying down on her stomach with her hands up uh-huh. and no head. When I first saw the body, I didn't believe that she didn't have a head on her, her body. So I had to take a separate look. Hmm. Yeah, I, I was in disbelief. Oh, uh. I had to take a second look to make sure that it don't have a head on the body. And when I noticed the head not on the body is when I trip off and start to scream and I run outside and I let the officers know. He just mutilated my daughter. He now cut off she head. I was in shock. It's the first time he ever displayed any violence towards me or Amara. First time. First time. Well, let me ask you something. You think that what he did was a was just a a f- a, a smile. Yay. What are you doing? He just did it out of anger, like he just tripped. But he doesn't. He doesn't have that kind of tendency. Mr. Allen, honestly speaking, mm-hmm. I can't answer that question because I don't know what this man was thinking. He deserved to be hung. Yes. To be hung? Yes. Yes. But then, death would be too easy for him. I want him to suffer, like how Amara suffered when he was mutilating her. Mm-hmm. I want him to suffer. I want him to become a old, old, old man and suffering still. I know I'm dead. A death could be too easy for him. You understand? Death can bring back my baby. So we might as well just suffer. Yeah. Do you ever imagine anything like this would have ever happened to you? Mr. Get up, Allen? Like, you know? Mr. Allen? I, I know September you were supposed to send her to school. No, well, actually I wanted to send her to school this term as the school, the term uh-huh, uh-huh, this, uh-huh. this, this, this term. I wanted to send her to start to go to school, but we didn't, we didn't set up to go to school as yet, but she was going and start this, this term. Did you ever, did you ever ask social services for assistance and whatnot? Yeah. For your child? Well, there was an instance where we needed some help. Yeah, and did they help you? And they, they, could, they said they couldn't. They couldn't. Help me. Okay. Yeah, they gave, they, me a help pa- you. they gave me a pamphlet a to pamphlet. tell me how to apply for the food card. And you never got through. No, I never really yeah, bothered to here. go back there, you know, yeah. because the, the, how the, old are you? the way I, I get treated there, it was like yeah. waste of time. Waste of time. I'm how old are you? I'm 41. Oh, you look well for your age. Thank you, sir. Thank you. <laughs> and the gentleman, the individual. He was 39. 39. So you all have just known each other four years. Oh yeah. Do you think yeah. you blame you, you blame yourself to an extent that that because of getting involved with this individual, you you know? Oh uh, yeah, I had to take the blame because I get involved with him. I mean. But he never displayed no violent tendencies. No. Never. 
Mm-mm. Was he not, not towards substance? not towards us? No, no. Marijuana. Mm-hmm. Well, yeah, he smoked marijuana. He smoked yeah. cigarettes, but that was it. Not even like used to ca- drink. Like cocaine and no, 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 no. no. Yeah. He never used to drink rum. Nothing. He didn't like alcohol. All he used to do was smoke weed and sm- um, cigarettes. That's it. That's why it's such a shock. What we call, what what would what would have advice do you have? But because I don't want to take you down that road too much about your daughter. I think that you know you're already going through, so I don't want to keep you know recollecting and telling me. But what would have advice you would have for single mothers out there who have intentions of pursuing relationship with, with persons? Say hi. Hi. Children uh, who have two two children, one child, and going to know fall in love with a man and think that you know they want they want to start a new life. What would have advice you would have for them is don't don't you can't trust nobody. You can't trust nobody because if they ain't doing it in the light for you to see, they're gonna do it in the dark, and then eventually later on in life. You're gonna find out what this person was doing to your child. So don't. If you could stay with the father, do that. Stick it out. Don't leave the father and go with somebody else. Especially if you have young children. You work, see about your children. If your children get big Do you enough, work? Well, I was a housewife at the time. Mm-hmm. You know, my hairdresser by trade. But I was, you sound, like, I was a, you sound like a very educated person. Thank you. Thank you. I realize you went to college and whatnot. Mm-hmm. Your parents alive? My father passed away. Mm-hmm. Um, my mother is in the States. My father passed away in 2018. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Thank you again. Thank you. Smile. What are you doing? Say hi. Hi. Are you embarrassed by excessive hair loss, itchy flaky scalp, receding hairline, teenage and adult cystic acne, open pores, old scar marks, puffy dark eye circles, aid spots, black lips, psoriasis, eczema or dermatitis? Do you want to get rid of deep lines and wrinkles, stretch marks, cellulite and discoloration around the neck, arms and between the legs? For a professional consultation and a microscopic analysis with Ms. Bagan, who has over 30 years of experience, call 673-7418 now. When NASA set out to explore the reaches beyond our world, they needed a material that would hold up to the demands of the unknown. Flexible titanium. Engineered from the same alloy used for missile heat shields, Flexon set the new standard in durable eyewear. Flexible titanium eyewear. Available at Neo Eyewear, 91D Main Road, Suite 1, Montrose Mall, Chagonas, 672-5052 or 3903196. Daisy's Exclusive is having a massive three-in-one sale just in time for Easter, Spiritual Shelter Baptist and Eve. Get huge discounts at store-wide on ready-made kits and panels, on fabrics, comforters, sheet sets, tablecloths and much more. Visit us in-store at Chagonas and Pennywise Plaza. Make this Ramadan unforgettable with Prasad's The Food King. Share joyful meals with loved ones with our wide selection of quality ingredients. Enjoy Halal Bone Goat per pound, now $21.99. Central Farm Duck, 3.5 pounds to 4 pounds, just $99. Du Jardin Frozen Veg Mix, 4.54 grams, 2 packs for $24.99. Fine Choice Calypso Pack Chicken, 2 packs for $20. Plus, more deals at Prasad's The Food King on Crown Parboiled Rice, 1 kg, 3 
three packs for $25. Distinction Milk, two packs for $27. Regal Dates, 175 grams, two packs for $14.99. Even more savings at Passage the Food King on Fresh Harvest, 750 gram brown sugar, three packs for $25. Nutramix Flour, 10 kg is now $74.99. Plus Fresh Harvest, one gallon soya bean oil for only $54.99. Hurry, offer available at all nine locations till April 10th or while stocks last. Wishing you a blessed Ramadan from Passat, the food game. Go live with Ian Allen and let the world take notice of your business. Be seen by millions on all their platforms, Facebook, YouTube, our iOS and Android applications, and website ianallen.org. Our network showcases you to viewers locally, regionally, and internationally. You'll be seen by millions. In 2023 so far, we've already crossed millions and counting. Our iOS and Android downloads have surpassed the 100,000s. Since 2016 to present, over 47 million people have viewed our videos. That is proof of our reach worldwide. No other network can outdo our proven performance. No one can beat us. Your live will stay on all our platforms indefinitely. You'll even own the rights to the production. Let Ian Allen transform your business and take it to a place you never thought possible. Call us today to book your spot. The millions are waiting. Are you ready to elevate your home this evening? Then look no further. Our exclusive eat sale is here to transform your space into a masterpiece. Ceramic 18 by 18 floor tiles from 9.95. Ceramic wall tiles from 12.95. Porcelain 24 by 24 floor tiles from 32.95. Specials on granite and quartz countertops and much more. Whether you're renovating your kitchen, bathroom or living room, our premium tiles provide durability and style at unbeatable prices. Don't miss out on these limited time offers. Visit our showroom today. Eden Barak from the management and staff of Classic Tiles Limited. Let your fashion do the talking with designs from Raquel Mona. Our boutique offers a wide range of clothing items, shoes, handbags, accessories, and perfumes for both the men and women. From brands like Robert Graham, Steve Madden, Coach, Victoria's Secret, Michael Kors, Ralph Lauren, Hush Puppies, and so much more. Visit our store at C3 Center Level 1 or give us a call at 765-6632. We are open Monday to Sunday, 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. Follow us on Facebook, Instagram, or on our website for fantastic deals. Chic Leisure Limited, the leading manufacturers of vermicelli. Now available pre-cut in parts and on parts in convenient package sizes. Whatever your needs, trust Chic Leisure Limited for quality products. Chic Leisure Limited, making your life easier. Wishing you a blessed Ramadan. Give the gift of food with a family in need. Available in store at 150, 200, 300, and 400 dollar food bags. Enjoy savings all month with Ramadan specials. Get small gala apples, 10 for 20. Carrots, three packs for 20. Rabi dates, 500 grams, 25 dollars. Ovaltine biscuits, six for 20. Chana, three pounds for 20. Raisin and Sultanas, two pounds for 20. 4Z vermicelli, 200 gram, four for 20. Happy condensed milk, two for 20. Regal almonds, 50 grams, three for 20. Nestle's full cream milk, buy three, get free. Carnation, 40 dollars. This Eid, you have the chance to win one of 12 shopping vouchers. Participate by spending $300 or more and submitting your entry into one of the designated entry boxes at any SNS Passage Supermarket stores. Promotion runs until April 10, 2024. Four convenient locations, Rio Claro, Mayaro and Freeport. SNS Passage Supermarket, loyal to local. Gentlemen, Eid Mubarak. We never, we, we never, I never really expected my my um, my program, my Eve Eve of Eid, and and to be like this. You know, I, that's why. You know, I, I to be honest with you, I had plans to do decorations today. We we got the decorator just to come in, and in fact, this morning just decorated the place really nice. And I stopped them. I said, Nah, I can't do that. I can't do that. I can't do that. I can't do that because people are really, really sad by this. And that's why, you know, these people, and what will happen? He's going, he going to be locked up there and the, the, the suspect. Now, this person is assisting police with the investigation. This is the, the individual here. He's a, he has been identified as... Aysan Content. Right, so Aysan, that's his name, Aysan. 
right? This is the individual who's assistant police here. Yeah? Put up that CG. He's assistant police. He's assisting police with the investigation. Okay, I can't say he did it, but he's assisting police with the investigation. This is the individual here who's assisting police with the investigation. All right, and today I spoke with the father and I brought back the mother. In fact, the mother was in the background, you know, and I want to, you know, but it's really hard for them. The father didn't see his child in three years, you know. He said because of the courts and all kind of all kind of challenges he had. He said he tried. He looked like a dad who really tried. And, you know, but this is the person who's assisting. Read my lips. Assisting police with the investigation. You understand? He has not been charged for any... He, ha he has not been charged for any, for any crime. Okay? So, again... Today, ladies and gentlemen, I spoke. I spoke with the father, the biological father, and the the uh, and the, the and in fact, in the mother's presence. Let's go straight there. Okay. How do you describe yourself as the father of the child, sir? Boy, I try all how the uh -huh. government. The government never did anything because I try when I dropped uh, fifteen hundred dollars and uh -huh. my mother come back from New York yeah. to drop. Um, Clothes, a big um, garbage bag full of clothes yeah. from a daughter. Yeah. And the police, when I come to drop it, mother say that she didn't want to in my yard. She was not accepting uh, anything. So we, don't, we don't want to go through all that. I understand. I mean, I understand what you're saying. But when was the last time you saw your child? About three years ago, the police said, do come back here until they settle that in court. So I went to the court. when back I went forth? Correct. When I went to the court... So you haven't seen your child three years ago? About three years, so correct. So like Christmas, you went by entering over the child living? Christmas, living. birthday, everything, and try. the child living? Yes, and she wasn't there. She oh. wasn't at that place. And the court and all tell me that um, I cannot bring up custody for my child yeah. unless the mother bring me up in court yeah. for child maintenance. Yeah. I say, what? So the child started grown so up. So you were denied access to your child? Correct. I was denied access to the child yeah. all the three years, or mostly four years. Uh -huh. And I went to Parents and Teachers Association. And the Parents and Teachers Association tell me that um, they cannot give all the information on which part yeah, my child is going yeah. to school. Because... So you did have contact with the mom? No, I didn't have no contact anything. How long have I broke it off? About three years. Yeah, about three years. She was a year when we... She was a year when Tola broke my up. My little baby, yeah. And when we uh -huh. broke up, I tell you, I say uh -huh. that I want to take my child. Uh -huh. They say, no, the child is still small. Let yeah. her stay with the mother. mother. So... so... You see how sometimes how... Now, we, I'm not blaming anybody, but you're not the only person I've heard this from, yeah? Like, in, in this case, but a lot, a lot of fathers out there who do have access to their children and, and who just do have access to their children is all kind of run around. And these are people who just, even though they want to come and see their child Christmas, they want they want to come, and, even though they want to come and, careful, even though they want to come and see their child for Christmas, they want to do this, they want to do that. There are a lot of fathers out there who just cannot, who in, in no way, in no way that, 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 you just can't because of the, the, the restrictions from the court. It's restrictions, the right? I get restrictions from the police, I get restrictions from the court, I get restrictions from parents and teachers association. To tell me that, if you come outside and see our next child, our next man, you smile. Yay. What are you doing? Yeah. Yeah. That is going to have conflict. Yeah. In the school. They don't want that. They do not want that. So they say we cannot give other information. Because the school will get a bad name. So you All I wanted to do was to see my child. Right, but you and this man here, this man who committed this act, you and he had have had no back and I never see the person. You never see the man. No, I never see him. But I thank never God. See him. She changed different people. And thank God. Thank but, God you never but, see him. But 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 
me like to tell you, between me and you, brother yeah. man, uh -huh. I think they're going to jail. No, 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 I go inside and catch a no, no, you don't want to go in. No, 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 but I know who you are and I know you know people. That's all I can leave it right here and tell you. I know who you are and I know you know people. You understand? Don't put yourself in trouble. He'll be, he'll be incarcerated. He might have be called, you know, before the courts and whatnot. And you'll have to leave it like that. But but what I, what, you know, but what is sad today is that the problems he went through to have access to his child. And that is what we want to be talking about. For all about the years. Him. For all the years. Every day I think about my daughter. Every day. So your mom used to send day. clothes and things like, you know? Yeah, she went to New York, she barrel, come back. And thing, and, you know? Yeah, she buy barrel with everything from a child. And when I bring it, it's like, no, we're not accepting nothing from all you. I will call the police. She say, um... Who tell you that, the mother? Yeah, the mother tell me that. And when she say, I will call the police, I say, well, I stay in here, let me see what the police is going to do. When so the police, when the police so come she, now... She, so she didn't want nothing? No, she say, so she not... So what did What told them uh, break up for? That was a whole situation by itself because the grandfather called me and told me that she was thing with her ex-man, yeah. right? Well, all right, they will go back all day, yeah. In Shogunas. Shogunas. And when the Shogunas in African ground, close to the Savannah. Because, exactly, yeah. around the Savannah. Correct, yeah. you well know. Yeah, believe me, I know. Oh, you I... know about all that? Oh, well, God. Easy. Because it's but... all back and all day, as he... Serious? Yeah, and I went, I went through and helped you out and all kind of thing. I didn't even know that. Yeah, that's years ago, like 2020. Mm -hmm. Or 2021, Correct, somewhere around there. Yeah. And I went down to African ground and I carry police and I tell, I tell the police and everybody thing, thing, thing. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Correct. So, you know, it's it, it just sad. I didn't it know just you sad. know about all that. I know, I know, believe me. I tell you, one thing I don't know is the coming the Lord, but you yeah, what's going on? Three years you were going to see your daughter and you blame the courts today. Well, I bet the whole government system, the police, the court, PTA, Parents and Teachers Association, I blame everything because I try at all angles to see my child. I even tried to file for custody on the blank man. Custody on the blank man. Hmm. Wow. Every so, day I think about my daughter. Every will you, day. Would you have to say to a woman leaving, leaving she husband or leaving she, boy, she child father to go to pick up somebody else now? What do you have to say? What would have advised? You really, I mean, I have to know who you're already going well, with. I had to say they're the up to no good because, I mean, if your grandfather could call me... No, and no, we're talking about, uh, like, I would have advised the woman and to... And, and to like, like, going back with the ex and the other... No, 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 like, like, just... Look what, okay, look what you went. She told her break up, look like all you're good. You're not in a back and all thing with her, I realize that. But you're not that kind of person, right? But I just tell, I tell you, but what would have right. advice you will have the men out there who are going through this? I know, cited from before and... Try to keep a hold, I don't know, as much as you could get to try to hold and protect your children because, I mean, a four year old could never do a big man anything, boy, yeah. as a man. So you heard it from your dad, what, what, what exactly went on? He never had the opportunity to see his child because of all kind of restrictions. All can he try, all of he bring clothes, he bring, and the mother can't deny it. What's her name again? Trisha. Trisha. Trisha Fellerel. Trisha. Just come a minute, please. Trisha, let me ask you something. So, let me ask you something. He really used to bring things for the child and thing? Like, yeah. Mr. Allen, uh -huh. I, I don't know, you know, because I wasn't even in, in the area yeah. for about a year. Yeah. Right? The police. And then, well, you did bring things that first Correct. night, right? Correct. Yeah. I was and my mother didn't know coming yeah. from New York to jump. But, but, but the courts had instructed you to do deal with the man? The court? No, 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 no. We had a falling out. Yeah? We had a falling out when we, um, 
when we People went there. Yeah, but why he, why he didn't have to, why he didn't I get a chance to see each other? He did get a chance when we were. But when birthday and Christmas come, would you would, would you have allowed him or you, or you tell him don't, don't come through? I never tell him that, but when we was in Shogunas. Yeah, I know in Shogunas by African he girl. Was, he was getting to see her, to see her. But yeah, I but like 2020, 2021. I wasn't, I wasn't stay with yeah. them. I left her there yeah. and my grandparents would be there and he uh. would come and visit her, right? Uh. Um, when I went up coming. What are you doing? Yeah. Something happened where I wasn't able to stay at the house and I yeah. had to leave for over a year uh -huh. and I wasn't here. So, and then I, the phone did get destroyed. I didn't have a phone. Much thing she said, but let me tell you something. You need to go to ianallen.org on YouTube. ianallen.org and listen to the whole interview. You need to get to ianallen.org. You need to do that. I'm going to show you. Now, we got a, a video of the, the barrel where the head was found. The child's head was found in the house. Now, no blood or anything, but I'm just showing you the area. Someone give us a, 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 a... Go ahead. Inside the house. No audio. Open up the line. So I call a good evening. You're live on Crime Watch. So we can take some calls. Okay, there's no audio in this. This is a normal video. Uh, this is inside of the house where the child lives. Right? Amara, her mother, and her stepfather live. This is a photograph of the stepfather. Right? Is a, right? There's a photograph of the person who's assisting police with the investigation. Go back to the video, please. Right? This is the area. Apparently they say this is the back of the house. All right, so, and this is where the barrel where the head was found. But there was no blood there. This is what we heard, that it was found in a blue barrel. Apparently this is the only barrel and somebody washed it off and everything. Hi, caller, good evening. You're live on Crime Watch. Hi, good evening, Ian. Good oh, evening. God, boy. This is, this, this is a criminal who did that act. You know what I think they should do to him? Huh. The same hand he used with the cutlass to cut out that neck. Take out that arm. Take it out. That is what I think they should do to that man. Let him suffer and see that the same hand he used. That is the same hand he's suffering from now. Okay, that is what they should do. So remember these videos, all these videos can be seen on ianallen.org, um, Ian Allen Network on YouTube. Go to my YouTube channel now and you'll see all the interviews. Now we are, we are, we are cutting the interview shorter, yeah? Because for one of time, but I'm showing you inside of the house as we, you know, in, we got a video of inside of the house. Go ahead. This is the area here. Hi caller, good evening. You're live on Crime Watch. Hi, caller. Good evening, Mr. Allen. How are you going, sir? Good. Mr. Allen, we've gone through. I did it for this nation, you know. And I wonder if social Allen, services visit these people and their boy. Look at them. Them that's only go and boast in the TV how much food how can they take services. away and how much can they rob. Watch. Forget them. Donald Cox is a waste of time. Forget everybody. The social police, all services, of them. Social watch. There's nothing But you have to feel sorry for the father of the child? You have to feel sorry for the father of the child? The man say you never get to see the child, boy. I tell the real men like that in Trinidad. Mm -hmm. And the man coming forward, the man coming forward to bring things for the child. I, I don't know why these circumstances, but look at the circumstances that bring it, that bring the situation now. Who coming forward to say I is to blame for that? Who coming forward for allowing, for, for disallowing the man? What social services coming to do now? What police coming to do now? True. What prime minister true. coming to do now? That is true. Why this nation better get in line with Haiti and jump off a cliff? For good. Hey, happy anniversary to you, eh? I need Navachi. Naratri. Hi, caller. Good evening. You're, li you're live and crying much. And there were two murders today, huh? Yeah, where? Where can you.
And all these videos are on our page, the, the video with the, the, the interview with the mother and father. A mother of two was gone down inside of the Hika in San Fernando. The deceased has been identified as Crystal Harry Charon of Budu Trace Extension. What? Clark said reported he received multiple threats for several months prior to the fatal incident around 7 a.m. This morning, Harry Charon had just left her home along Jarvis Street in Bistabel and was seated in a red Suzuki registration PCR 6695. Look at this. Normal, normal. So that's when you just let me see the video. So this can be seen on my page. Is that as I'm going in the card there? Yeah? Oh my god. Huh. Who wanted her dead? And they took her purse? Nothing, they took nothing. And then, ladies and gentlemen, a teenage boy died after he was. <laughs> Ivan Tulsi, um, this is a shot from Ivan Tulsi. Hmm, look at the pretty girl. Want justice, was she? Go ahead. But you are just low work and I don't think we will get justice. If they want it, go bloody wrong. I can't handle it because it's a children and a mother. Nobody can take a children mother, please. Yeah, she had an incident with a fella on the hill. We like by the house there. Yeah, she living higher up. He packed up the car and come out and they had a little disagree before New Year's, right? Like a Sunday, right? New Year's night. She well, she tell me she tell him. New Year's night, he come home. We go to sleep. We hear gunshot in the house. Right, they shoot the window in front. Yes, and not. We reported it to the police. Well, the police and my really say much, but they said they were investigate on it. Right, on the 18th, they tried to bomb a bomb the house with flambo. He was waking. We were telling we all the fire. The fellas and them run. Then on the 20th, the next day they come back around after two. And they try again, but they try it in the room, but they didn't get fire. But my brother, all of them get the fire, all the all the fire. To the family, I would like to meet with you all. Just to the family of, of Crystal. To the family of Crystal, I would like to meet with you all. Okay, just to let you know that social media persons put it up. To the family of Crystal, I would like to have an audience with you all. We need to find them who kill this, the, the, this young girl. We need to find them. It don't work like that. Leave people alone. Don't kill them. Don't kill them. Serious. This thing called love, it's not a lot of people can handle that, you know. You see this thing called love, it's not a lot of people, it is not a lot of people can handle this thing. Ladies and gentlemen, also a mother, of, uh, also ladies and gentlemen, a teenage boy was died after he was stabbed by his common-law wife at their Sandy Grandy home on Tuesday. The deceased has been identified as 90-year-old Nicholas Batiste of, Sha of Sahadin Trace, Vega de Arapu, Sandy Grandi. Batiste Batiste and his 25-year-old girlfriend were at their home when the reporter got into an argument. During the altercation, the woman armed herself with a knife and stabbed Batiste in the chest. Residents of the area heard the commotion and notified the police of a domestic disturbance in the community. When the officers arrived at the occasion, they discovered Batiste lying on the ground, bleeding from stab wound. They subsequently conveyed him to the Sandy Grandi General Hospital, where he was pronounced dead. And shortly after, the officers of Sandy Grandi CID apprehended the woman and seized the murder weapon pending investigation. So this is, so, so ladies and gentlemen, again, we have so much to tell you. And, and, and you know what I did today, what I did today with respect to the young girl, the, the girl that died, the four-year-old, I just tried the last two years, a total of 12 children. In the last two years, a total of 12 children under the age of 13 were murdered in this country. And in fact, 11-year-old Ezekiel Hoggins died after he was shot in the head by a bullet allegedly intended for his relative along Laventil Road on Thursday, 22nd of February, 2024. Also, ladies and gentlemen, 10-year-old Faith Peter King was gone down alongside her sibling, 14-year-old Ariana Peter King, 17-year-old Shane Peter King, and 19-year-old Tiffany Peter King at their home along La Retreat Extension, the High Sogonapo Arima. Remember, I was on that scene also. 
Also, ladies and gentlemen, five five year old Shaquille Williams died at Moncton Hospital on Saturday, 2nd of September 2020, after he was dropped off unresponsive marks of violence around his neck earlier that day. Also, ladies and gentlemen, a one year old boy died at Portispin Hospital where he was beaten by his father in the, Bel in the Belmont district on Monday, the 17th of July. Also, six year old Kylie Maloney, who lived at Cross Street Foster Road in Sandy Grand, he was shot and killed at a house along Blake Avenue extension on Sunday, the 8th of January, 2023. Also on the first, and the, also one year old, Nova Barrington was shot dead along with her mother, 33 year old Sasha Elliott, while her father, 40 year old Akil Bar Barrington, was injured during a shooting on Monday, 19th of December, 2022. Also, ladies and gentlemen, three year old Nazim Owen was among four persons shot dead in a car along the Digo Martin Main Road on Saturday, the 22nd of October. Also, ladies and gentlemen, nine year old Jamal Bob. Morris was shot and killed at African Grounds in the Paris Chagones on the 15th of October 2022. Also, ladies and gentlemen, nine-month-old nine, nine Celine Ramsarup died after she was fed insecticide by her mother at her home in New Grant on Princess Tongue on Wednesday, 21st of September. Also, ladies and gentlemen, on, on seven-year-old Mackenzie Hope Risha was found murdered at her number seven extension, Palo Seco home, after she was beaten to death by her mother on Friday, 19th of August, 2022. Also, ladies and gentlemen, 12-year-old Levi Lewis, alongside his 31-year-old mother, Abio Kojo were found murdered at their La Chuse Road penal home on Tuesday the 10th of May. Also, ladies and gentlemen, six-year-old Zachariah Charles was murdered after her after the top three V that he was beaten to death and died as a result of blunt force trauma injuries to the head. So, ladies and gentlemen, so many young people we have lost in the last two years. So many. Yeah? The body of a man who was found murdered in Manzilla on Monday has been identified. Okay, he has been identified as Rakesh Bojam of Northwest Drive, Partner Village, Digo Martin. Again, the body of a man who was found murdered in Manzanella, just to let you know, has been identified as 44 year old Rakesh Bojam of Northwest Drive, Partner Village, Digo Martin. Around 9 a.m., residents of Manati Street, Trust, Cocal Estate, discovered Bojam like first body lying on the ground. They immediately notified the police and officers of Eastern Division and the Homicide Bureau, led by ASP Janki, Inspector Raj Ragbear, and Inspector Ramki Soon, along, among others, responded and observed Bodram's body bleeding from wounds to the head and feet. The officers subsequently summoned the DMO to the scene who viewed the body and made their pronouncement and ordered its removal. So, ladies and gentlemen, I just wanted to show you even a little part again, because remember, you can go to Ian Allen, Ian Allen, Ian Allen Network on YouTube. So, the Right, so go back with the continuation where the mother and father, we were chatting with them. So you regret not having him? To, so you think that you not... Uh, I wanted them to know his daughter, you know, I wanted them to have but a But he didn't come true. But when I was there in the house, yeah. permanently, yeah. you know, I didn't see him and he didn't know I but was But he didn't know where he was and all kind of thing. He didn't right. know I was back in But for two years, you couldn't search and all too? I passed, I really passed. He passed? Every time I passed, I don't know, I was there, you describe this man? How do you describe this man? He's All a, good? He's a good person. Yeah. He's a good person. Everybody good for you, you know. <laughs> he's a good person. He's a good person. I just couldn't deal with certain of some of his bad tendencies, so you know. Well, I hope that all you know, you know, see all can talk and you know, do you know, she need all the support she can get right now. She carried your child. What's that? Yeah, she need all the support you need, you need, you know, you know, counseling, a lot of things. And I really hope that, you know, you, ex you extend the olive branch and help out and see what, what you can do. Because she carried your child. Everybody make decisions, you know, but don't just, you know. To cut off her for you, he be here to you know, then, right? Yep. To cut off her child here. There's something very serious. There's something demonic. It is demonic. Four year old girl, not even a boy. But she said the man never displayed them kind of tendencies, you know. Can do you to do she said the man like never displayed them kind of tendencies. Hmm. Smile. Yay. What are you doing?
There's nothing more you can say. It just every, every everybody lost for channel. Everybody, I mean, everybody know you, but I mean, it just sad. It, 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 there's no, there's nothing I can tell you. You lost your daughter. I'm you lost your only daughter. Your only daughter in your whole life. Correct. You have no other only children. Only child. Only child exit on the face of this earth. Correct. Are you saying that he was denied access to the child by the police and all these different uh, agencies, the, court. the courts and whatnot? And that's why he's saying that Parents he, he didn't know, you know, but he didn't tell the, the child needed to see the biological father. He didn't think that the child needed yeah, to see I this was, man. I wanted her to see, I wanted uh, to see her father, but I wasn't getting any chance to come to where he works. Sometimes you, you can't really predict Sean on where he is. Uh. If okay, but do you job, know his parents? Yeah, I know his parents. Well, do you know where his parents live? Yeah, I do. So yeah. why never check them out? I, I just didn't get Mr. Allen. If you understood the situation I was in before, yeah. you would understand why it is. I could not really go and look for anybody uh, at the moment. Right? The man was keeping you away from everything then. He can't lock you down. Well, no, not necessarily. I, I just choose to, you know, do what I had to do in order to is move on like to the future. kind of thing, you know? A narcissist. Yeah, you cannot, you know? Lock you down here where you're going away, checking your phone, mm -hmm. thing, thing, thing. That was just it. No, 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 no. He wasn't like that. He was not like that at all. He didn't used to do them things. Okay, so you said the only day he ready trip was last was night? Was, yeah, last night and the couple days before that, leading up to last night was the But did you put them out recently? No. No. I never had to put them out. My answer. They did something where we had to leave. I thought um, old lady still live in that house. Yeah, but she left. Oh, she left. Okay. We have a, a court case going on with her right yeah, now. Yeah, I, no, I realized that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Awesome, awesome ideas. Okay. In this situation, to turn good man bad boy, because if you're living a life good, and then something like that come to happen to you, try all means by government government institutes to try to protect and to see your child so that to nurture, schooling, everything so that the child can go good, university, everything, and then bam, a situation like this. Really, really and sad. all that you try. Also, ladies and gentlemen, I visited the house today and I spoke for a couple of minutes. Go ahead outside. I just wanted to show you the house where the four-year-old was decapitated at, at this residence here. Um, well, police, police have, um, in the area, as you can see, the, the, Everybody just wanted to see the house. This is the condition of the house. Apparently, the child head was found in that blue barrel to the back there. In fact, someone sent us some photos a short while ago just to show you. And um, it's very, it, it's just graphic. You know, you will see where they went inside, and the it's just terrible. It's just really, really, really terrible. And um, the person is in custody. Apparently, if the the mother shared a relationship with a man. Um, have, have the, 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 the child father and her separated so um, she, she moved on and this is uh, as a result of that and that's why you have to be so cautious who you, who you invite into your life you know it might sound funny yeah, but Pandey said the former prime minister said the late Pandey ba Bazwe Pandey said that that in politics there are certain statements that will live on in politics has a, he said politics has a morality of its own. And one statement that the current prime minister made, and I think that it's a, it, 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 it's a statement that will generations to come will, will remember that statement. Choose your man wisely. You see that statement? Know who you're getting involved with. Know when you leave your husband and you're pursuing a relationship with another man. Sometimes you don't know the tendencies of that individual. You don't know. And there's a saying, ladies and gentlemen, that new broom with sweet clean for the very first time. People will come and they'll be so nice to bring your roses. But my God, they have a side there. And my grandmother used to always say, eh? my grandmother used to always say, see me and come live with me. It's two different things. You know? And people treat you real good. And sometimes people back and all each other every day and falling out and quarreling. Sometimes they have the best relationship ships you know yeah so we're in front of the house here ladies and gentlemen and you know we're gonna go uh we'll let you know what's happening shortly thank you yeah go ahead so i, wanna, I just want to show you back the inside of the house somebody asked me if they could just see the inside and the barrel and whatnot go ahead No, inside. Start it over, please. Yes. Hi, caller. Good evening. You're live and crying much. Go ahead. 
This is inside of the house of CGs and Hi caller, good evening. You're live on Crime Watch, 6714062. Take the audio down when you're set when you are calling. So at least today you understand what exactly went on. You saw all parties, you know. 6714062. Hi caller, good evening. You're live on Crime Watch. This is where Mar Amara and her mother, stepfather, live on 5th Street, Five Rivers. It's a blue barrel in the, where it is alleged that they said that the, fi the, the, the head of the child was found in that barrel. This is really, really, really sad. Really, really sad. You know, and you ask what, what's going to happen with these people, and we can open up the lines for me, 671-4062. Those of you who are calling, 1868. Those of you who are looking to be from all over the world. Those of you who are in Trinidad right now. Those of you who might be making yourself your, your way to the temple. Remember, there's no show tomorrow. There's no program tomorrow. Well, ladies and gentlemen, um, we are out of time now. And tomorrow we're going to be back. Um, on Thursday, I'm going to be back. There'll be no show tomorrow. And, um, but all these videos that you have seen, all the interviews, we have separated the interviews. And you can go to Ian Allen Network on YouTube and look at it, or Ian Allen Network on Facebook. And that is why I tell you every day, subscribe. Follow us on Facebook, subscribe on YouTube, on the Ian Allen app, download the Ian Allen app, it's for free, Ian Allen app on your Android phone or any iPhone, any of these two phones in the world, and it's free for you to look at crime watch, and then you have the website, ianallen.org, so there are a lot of options, and you, and you keep supporting crime watch, and also, ladies and gentlemen, that girl, Crystal, that died, I'm Ask a family to get, you know, get a family to get in contact with me. We want to get justice for that girl. That is so, so sad. That is so, so, so sad. Hi, caller. Good evening. You're live on Crime Watch. Let's take that call before we go. Hello? Hello? Hi, good evening. Right, so ladies and gentlemen, again, happy Navratri, Navratri to all our Hindu brothers and sisters and from the management and staff of Crime Watch. And also, ladies and gentlemen, Eid Mubarak to the Muslim community. Wow. This has been a day. This is really, really. I, I saw, I, I heard a call come in. Go ahead. Hi, hi, caller. Hi, good day, Ian. Uh huh. Um, I'm not judging anybody or trying to be judgmental, but Ian, if I, I don't know what situation the lady was in, but I wasn't leaving my girl child, Ian. But girl, the circumstances. I, you have to look back at the video. Go, go back and look back at it on, on, on my on, on Ian Allen Network on YouTube, so you will really understand what happened. So some you can look back with it, look back at it, look back at the entire show, 
And remember, advertisers, those of you who wish to advertise and get your product on from Thursday, get in contact with us on 294 all the numbers there. Message us and whatnot there, everybody who's watching. And have a very good night. And you will see me on Thursday at quarter to six. Thank you again. Eid Mubarak and happy Navatri to the Hindu community. Good night.